Hey guys, welcome to part 2 of Life 2D tutorial. So let's continue with what we're doing. Last time I teach you the eyes blinking, this one, and eyeballs moving, this one. So, uh, wait, I think I've done this arm for like a little bit. Like, wait, I, I didn't teach you guys last time this one, did I? Uh, wait, I, I remember I did teach you like the head rotation here. Well, actually, the arm one is pretty simple too. This, just put, uh, just create this rotation deformer and like you put in the right position right here just use the control button again and just put it right here and you have to go like when you go to the keyframe up here so wait so I, I think I should just like this so we can see that better okay uh uh wait so I have to close everything like this is sometimes a, bit, a little bit annoying I know it right, uh, okay so uh like you for example you have to like when you move over this way you have to move it up right here and the other way, just move it up like this way because you have to make sure that you have the whole uh, like 30 degree of your hands moving around. For example, like you, you move at this point and you want to move at this point and this point, every point of it, you make sure that you have every point of it, okay? So the other one right over here, wait. Uh, the other hand, same as well. You make sure that you have every point of it like you're moving like this, okay? So uh, Next, what we're gonna do is like moving the arms right here, these arms. So same, just uh, remember to select also your hand here. Oh man. So you can like move it together and create a rotation deformer. So I'm gonna test set this one to right arm, I guess. So this one is the right arm and you're just gonna create this one, okay. And next, you're gonna like move it at the point right there again move at the point use the control button again okay like i teach you last time so uh you have to like try to make sure if, if the position is right so it must look kind of a bit weird but it's quite normal because it's kind of hard to adjust to the right position you see so i think if, if you're like this one is already okay because it's really hard to adjust the right position actually okay okay so uh just up a little bit okay Okay, this is freaking me out. Okay, okay. I think this position. Once the position is done, so you can create an an uh, try to create a parameter. So uh, let me name this one as right arm. So uh, forget about ID. If you want to change the ID, it's it's better for a reference. Okay. So uh, set keyframes again. I, I think you should put these together so it will be better for your looking. Like I suggest you to put the head up there and the eyes up there because. Like because you know heads are up there, so so you can adjust the position, and you can also uh wait, and also you can add a folder as I remember. So uh by pressing the button right right over here, here I hope you see my mouse to do. So right over here you can create a folder so you can uh like put everything in there so it will be better for your looking. But for me I'm kind of lazy doing that. Okay, so let's just go for this one. Uh, like you have to move up. Like, your your highest point is this one, you want to know. But because you go like this, this is kind of a freaking weird, but, like, yeah, you, you see, it's there's an error doing this. Because it will it will say, like, if I thought you, your hand is this and thought you go to this way. So don't do that too much. Just go to the go to the point that that is, that is not, like, too far from the other side. So here, like, you think this is the... Uh, the maximum of your point to go. Like, remember, don't move these ones, or it will look actually look really, really weird. So I suggest you to like, you have to be like, uh, move, uh, adjust the point really well. So for the other way, same method, just like move it this way. So you see, it's like 30 degree, 30, 330 degree moving like that. So. You have to make the eval like that. Remember, don't remember, don't put, uh, don't put uh, the this rotation with this rotation together because it's gonna cost you for like extremely weird to like it will move extremely weirdly. Okay, so just like this. Okay, so once you're done with this one, so let's start with the other arm. So I'll just do this part myself. I'll just stop the video. Okay. So I've done the uh, the left arm. So you can test that out. So like if you move right here, so you can move freely all over. So that would be uh, what we want in the animation tab. So I'll do the tutorial about that. 
too. So these are the basics for this one. So as for uh, let's talk about the legs because the hair is quite a bit complicated. Okay, so let's talk about the legs. So this would be better for you to see. Yeah, I know it's kind of ugly for Ella to wear for shots like this. <laughs> okay, so uh, let's select her fifth. Just use rotation again. Okay, like this. After that, just move. Same same thing, just move to the part where you want. Okay, like this. So you have to test it. Maybe you can test that out. Like, test if it looks... And stop, stop making this. Okay. So you can test that out. Like, can test it. Okay, so after you've done this, then set the keyframe again. Actually, I don't mind doing the tutorial because I, I actually haven't done setting up this model myself. So I just like do it together with you guys. I haven't set, set I haven't done setting up Ella and like I haven't done like so many stuff and and I don't have much time, you know. Okay, so uh, let's set let's set the keyframes again. So I can move this way. Alright. Okay, maybe just a little bit higher. Oh, <laughs> but no, humans won't do this anyways. Okay. It's a bit too high actually, but I don't care. Is this actually a bit too... I think it's a bit too far away. Okay, so the other side, same method, just move like this. Just, so as for the legs, I think it would be a little bit, like a little bit I think I've set the point for the wrong thing. I should have just set it right here. Maybe it will look better. Okay, so what about I, let's do it again then. I was, I was, oops, oh man. Where am I? Okay, here. Okay, let's set it again. Here. Yeah, I think this one's better. Okay. Uh, so the other way, same thing. Just move like this. So make sure that it moves all the points. Because if it doesn't move more, all the points, you might end up seeing the other, like, you might end up seeing like different like you cannot you cannot move all the points if you just don't do all of like sometimes you go to this and you cannot move any further like that so you have to move all the points okay okay i think this one's done and let's go with the uh foot remember to uh name it uh name it because it will be quite confusing if you don't uh, it happens to me before, so I have experience of that, okay? So let's just continue. Oops, we got to press the control button. Uh, here. So let me try to press it out. Okay, it's kind of a bit, okay, I guess. Let me just move a little bit over here. Wait, I think it's a bit too high. So. Hmm. Oh man, I just, I think this one is not... Oopsie daisy, I, I... Okay, I think this one is the middle point, isn't it? Oh man, okay, I don't care, it doesn't look that good, but anyways. So let's go with... Here, and same thing like before, move all the points. So, using life today isn't that hard, unless you have to do all the basics. I mean, I, uh... What's, what's wrong with me today? Okay, I mean, I'm glad you have to do like really, really advanced. Or it is quite easy as you, as you think. Just don't, don't uh, judge a book by its cover, okay? It's not always that hard. Like, literally isn't this hard if you want to get the basics. Okay, so... Okay, I think this one's done. Like, the right leg is done. So let's test it out. Oh man, I forgot to link them. Oh man, this is terrible, okay. I forgot to link them together, man. 
Okay, wait, 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 wait. Let's do this one all over again. <laughs> oh my god. Sorry guys if I give you the wrong the wrong guy. Okay. Oh man, why did I do this? Okay, so I have to delete this rotation for now. Okay. Okay, I have to do this all over again. Okay, so sorry if I do this the wrong way. So okay. I forgot to land it. That's yeah. so stupid. Okay, wait. So I'll just Oops, I forgot to select. Man. Oh. Man, why make that stupid? It's not the first time I'm using this road. Okay. Mm. Oops. Well time to set it all over again. <laughs> okay, sorry, I just I'm gonna set it all over again. These are mistakes I always make sometimes. Yeah. Okay. Okay, just gotta move it to the right point. Okay. I think I'm doing it a bit fast, don't you think? Am I fast, guys? That's why I think- that's why I think- wait, did I do something wrong like that? I was like... Okay, so, uh... Okay, let's go like this. Oops. Haven't set the keyframes. Okay. Keyframes. Okay, so this one's done, and then let's go back to the here. So, other like this, and okay, just a little bit further. Man, I forgot to. Oh man, forgot to. Forgot. Wait, just gotta give it. Uh, well, wait. Uh, this is another tool called for division. It will be better for your art meshes. Like, it can have like divide into four parts more art meshes. That means you can adjust better. So this one is uh adding out art meshes tool. So like you add this one over here and you can add this one. So it will be better for your uh, adjusting. Okay, and I just need this tool right now. Yeah, I'll tell you more about that. I need this. Okay. Okay, I, I don't know. Let's not mind this one first. <laughs> Let's do the important things we have to do first. Okay. Uh, like this. Okay. There's discovery. Okay, this is the mistake that you always do. Like, don't go too high. Like, just a little bit over there. And just stop in that. And after it's like it's normal, so you just move out a bit over here, and it will be nothing, okay? So I'll just go a bit further more. Okay, here and the same as here. Here. Okay, so you're done with this leg. And I'll do the other one, so do the same thing, yeah, whatever. So, if then the other leg, like you've done the the um, the hands and the, and the legs. So as for the mouth, the really complicated one, I uh, suggest you maybe I should say suggest you to watch maybe YT's video because it's really 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 annoying. And if I do it in a video, I sh I will use like really long time. But maybe I should do some of the parts with you. So, let me go get my thing right now. This is the finished product that I've made. And it's uh, it's not that great, I think. So, I want to show you another, like, show again. Because I tried this for two times, and I think the result still isn't that good. So, I'm going to just try it again with you guys. So, I suggest you to get Siege YT of those um, mouth materials. And after you open them, then they should be right here. And... Well, let me show you how to do it. It's kind of a bit annoying, so first of all, let's select all of the parts that you need in them to animate. Like, not the mouth guide, it's just for your guide to see how you do that. So, maybe I should put the file down below too, yeah. 
in the description. So select all of them and press auto, like select and the mesh generator. Wait, did I do it? Okay, okay. And after that, you should be able to like, oh man, this is annoying. Uh, wait, so I just do that. So I was so you add this one and remember that uh, you should choose this mile, uh, this PSD because you're gonna be in this together so it can like you cannot just put it in another one so you just put this one. After that just press this one so you can uh, with some you can have your art matches there. So after that, okay. Okay, actually you can just delete the backgrounds. Okay. Uh well so let's set the let's just put everything right here. Yep. Actually it's the size, you can adjust it by pressing the shift button so it won't be like oh, a little bit thin or something. So you can just press the shift button. I forgot, just put it in position right here. Yeah. So, uh, well, just put these ones uh, down the, down your, the ones gonna, you're gonna animate. So, set the opacity of all of this to 50 because it's gonna, like, it's gonna, uh, it's gonna be like a little bit uh, transparent, so you can look better at them. Okay. So I forgot press enter, and then it's done. Wait, I forgot to open my workspace. I think this one's better for me to look. Okay. Uh, so let's start with the mouth. I'm gonna set the set the key for these. I mean, set the meshes first. So here we go, and then I suggest you to use uh like. To use for division, that it would be much better for this edit. Okay, so when you animate one of them, just delete everything. Okay, just okay. So first of all, let's just put everything into into uh, the parameter. So as you see, there are like nine of uh, nine nine of. Uh, the different shapes of mouth. So we're gonna add. Okay, so let's put them. Let's gonna uh, like this first. So we're gonna add the keyframes and like I'm gonna be like mouth and this one as well mouth. So just gonna combine that together so you can see there there will be different kind of mouths here. So uh, wait, there, there are twelve mouths. Sorry. So how do you exactly gonna set like? Like twelve maps. So first of all, here you're gonna have need four four uh, keyframes. So how do you do that? Just press bend it over here, and then for example, you want there is a keyframe right on this point. Just press it like that. I hope I'm not talking too fast, okay? So you need four keyframes. After that, just press done. And the other one for need three. So after that, when you combine, it's actually twelve. Okay, wait. Just gonna. Okay, it's gonna be twelve. So let's. Uh, start with uh, the lips, the lip first. Let's start with the upper lip, so you can see uh, many of these. So the first map is going to be here, here like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, like this, like the first one. So the layers are already uh, like customized. So just first of all, this mouth. We're gonna do the first one. So remember that the, not the wrong keyframe because if you mess that up, the I mean, if you mess the alder up, it would be like so weird when you're talking like that, okay? Okay, so let's start with adding four division, so it will be smoother to move. So, add four division button, it's just right here. After that, just press done, and use this deformer path tool. Okay. Uh, like, I just did better because I, I, I sometimes I made it really bad. So I have to just, I have to just, it's better. But I want to do all the steps because if I do all the steps, my, my video is going to be so long and it's when my, and my storage is going to, you know. Okay. So after setting up these, pretty simple, just, just, uh, wait, just going to close this one. Just going to pause this down here. Okay. So you're going to like adjust this. Wait. 
I think I'm gonna like put it in a better position. Like, okay. Like you're gonna adjust it. Mm -hmm. So like this. Uh, it might look a bit of that ugly. So so you're just gonna follow it. Like this, you've got one mini more, right? I hope you guys get what I mean, okay? So it's kind of look a bit of an ugly, but it's kind of normal because it does that every time, okay? So let's let's try like a few more because, because maybe doing one that you guys might get a bit confusing. So okay, so let's go to the second one. So you're gonna change so open like keep your eye on the second one. Uh, so it's already. A, Okay, so you're just gonna follow it again. Because some of them are have mouths, like have the tongue them. So I have to like try to try to do my best to explain it. I'm not gonna explain it, okay? Okay. Since I've been done tutorials before. Okay, so wait, what about I move it? Okay, so there's the second mouse, so you see it changes like this. So let's go to maybe the fourth one. I mean, fifth. This one's the fifth one. So there's the tongue here. Same, just adjust this right over here. Okay. Remember, don't just don't just remember to use these because it will make you like change from this to another one. Okay. The former. Okay, so let's go to the lower lip for this part. Same, just use for division and the firmer path. So the lip, this is the lower lip. So you put down here, like you follow this. I'm quite slow, actually. Uh, I think I, I, I just need to speed up the video, yeah. Okay. This one works. Okay. So, what about the tongue? Uh, okay, here we go. Let's start with the, like, the mouth. The inner part, what, what, where, which is, like, uh, really dark. So, is that for division, like, for division as well? Oops, I think I'm gonna, wait. What about let's reset all of the arm matches? It looks kind of a mess here. It's kind of a bit of a mess here. Okay. I will tell you how to export this one into your character. Gonna maybe this one I, feel, I will just set it at, as heavy. So use for division. Oh my god, maybe this one we don't need it. Okay, just like this. So it's just a circle here, and you have to set it to firmer path for the whole circle. So I suggest you to have eight points so it will be better just like that. I know it's really slow to do this, but no, there, there's only this way to do it about. I wish there was a faster way, but no. Uh, here. Okay, so it's done and just adjust it. Like, you see the mouth is like this. So you just put it, like, you just squeeze that in here. Squeeze everything in here. Okay, wait. I'm just gonna just a little bit here and here. I hope you understand what I'm doing. Feel free to ask questions. So here is the part like this. So we see it would change. Oh, just forgot to build up the lip. So I'll. Wait, let's go with the tongue here. So as you see, the whole part is like, 
is uh, on the tongue. But we still need to uh, like adjust it. Okay. Wait. Uh, I'm just gonna do this. Do. Oh my god, it looks a bit weird. Wait, let's just see what he's done again. <laughs> I'm stupid. Is that, I don't think it looks that great. Let's just do it again. Okay. Oh man, let's just stop saying that. Okay. Uh. Okay, I think now that's the only way I can do it. Okay. Let's just use the deformer path to again. Same. Same, just set it like here and. Oops, I forgot to tell you one more part. Just tell you later, okay? So this part... Oh, wait, sorry. I, sorry, this part doesn't have to add, like, the former path. It's, it's, it's just if you're... You have to add, like... You want the tongue inside, so you need to copy the the mouth ID into the tongue right over here. Just, and press enter, and it's in the hair. So, like, the mouth, you want it to be like this. So... This is the mouth here. I forgot to tell you one more thing. Right over here, if that this is the lip, like, uh, this, this one, okay. Like, if this one, you want to put, like, inside here, so you have to delete the deformer path of the points. But so don't worry, they won't disappear in the other keyframes. To delete the, the, uh, these, you just have to press the backspace button on your computer. And, whoop, it's disappeared, just like this, okay? Alright, just like this like squeeze it as as thin as possible like this so and then you add the add these deform, just use the deformer path tool again remember to stick on the parts where it's this blue because it's the part that oh man it's not that oh stop it okay let's, let's just move right here uh Remember, I'm not an expert at this. I just only know the, the the ones that I need to use in my series. Um, and stop doing this. Stop. Oh man, did I just wait? Oh, I gotta just. I made a mistake. I made a mistake right here. Okay, and uh, just like this. Yep, and this should be done. And oopsie daisy, why did I? Okay, it should be a little bit upper. Okay, just move it at the right point, please. Okay, what about this part? Okay, I think it's done, so... Oh, stop moving, you idiot! Just, just go to... Just listen to me, okay? Okay. Oh, finally. So, you'll have to, like, follow this one again. Oops. Maybe I should have been. I should have been. Oh, man, why is it out of the way? Okay. Like, you put it inside, like, this. Oh, man, why is it like that? Why? Why do you leave the... Like you get inside here, just put everything inside, okay? Sorry, I just made it the worst one ever. I just didn't adjust that well, okay? This is too big and I cannot see, like... Like, I like this, so it will open eventually, like, like this. So, <laughs> where were the other mouths? Look at that for yourself! Oh wait, one more thing. And that is the teeth. So same thing, just... Wait, just, uh... Just move... Just use. Okay, so same. Just put your mouth, uh, your mouth of the ID into the teeth because you're gonna put that inside your mouth. So as the teeth, just move like here and like adjust it as you're right. 
in the right place. So you'll be like this. So it'd be great. So as here, you don't have to adjust it because the mouth is already, is already in there. But you have to make at least make sure that it's close to the mouth. Okay, so uh, after you've done it, you should have seen the mouth moving quite smoothly ever. So I'm not going to do the other ones because it's very tiring. Yep. Okay. So just do it on your home, uh, on your own. Good luck. Or maybe you should watch Siege Whitey's video. She just made all of the mouths together. Okay. Uh, I forgot to tell you one more thing, and that is you have to export the mouth. How to do that? Just go to here and then go to the parts that you animate already. So and then press export parts, and then after that, go back to the model. Go back to the model right here, and then you can just like uh, you just drag it into your model like this. Okay. Like I've done this one, and I have to drag it into here. Drag into here, like. Right? Okay, wait. After this, I've imported it, so you can just delete the the movement there. Okay, just just set a wrap deformer for it. A wrap deformer is gonna help us. A wrap deformer here. Just gonna. So actually, you can change the color of the of it. So for this one, I mine is red, so I'm just deep red. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay, here. Man, just stop it. Okay, like this. So it's red. So it becomes red. So I can just delete this one. This is just for me seeing seeing better. Like, oopsie, I made, I made it all right. Sorry. Okay. Sorry. So I have to only make the only make only make this one right. So wait. Oh yeah, choose the it's the upper left and the lower left. You can just. And the lower really super red, and I think it would be perfect. Done. So the inside is actually like the same. Oh um, man, what did I do? Oh um, man, why? Why is this happening? Oh um, man, I don't care. Just change it to red. All red. Okay, and this one. Why do I have to do this all over again, man? So this one. I might. I made some mistakes here, so I have to like change a bit. And this one. I should have just do it at the beginning. Wait, did I set the upper teeth to red? Oh, oh, no, okay. It's fine. Okay. Lower lip, red. This one as well. Red. Okay. I think I've done all the steps. Okay. Looking pretty great. Nah. Why do I have to have some spaces out of here? Okay, I think my adjustment isn't that. I don't care. I'll just get it out from the other place. If it, if it just stop not working, I'll just I'll just do it again anyway. Okay, so actually you won't see it anyway. Man, why does it disappear right here? Just, why does it disappear? Okay, I don't care. So I think today's video is just right here. This is quite too long if I do it for longer. Okay, so I think I hope you learned something. At least you can adjust the body and the mouth and your eyes right now. I haven't talked about the brows and the hair and 
yeah, I haven't talked about these two, so I'll just talk about them. And I'll do some extra ones, uh, like for the wings or tails or maybe like this one. Like maybe like her. Yeah. So uh, thank you so much for watching. See you next time. If you have any questions, you can ask down below. Okay. Goodbye.